Well, good morning, folks, and thank you for the welcome and the introduction and the invitation to come to be with all of you. How beautiful is this? It's, I feel so good. <laughs> and I'm so excited about why I'm here. But just so you know, my name is Father Ron Hoy. I belong to a religious order, and it's named Vincentians. I'm a Vincentian priest. Have you heard of us? <laughs> so no, okay. <laughs> I hear you. A lot of people haven't, but you know, you've heard of the Franciscans. Yeah, you know, there's Franciscans, there's Benedictines, um, Dominicans. Well, we're Vincentians, and we're like them, except we're better. That's how I. No, just kidding. <laughs> But the founder of my community is probably someone you've all heard of, St. Vincent de Paul. Have you heard of him? Okay. Did someone say yes, baby? Okay, yeah. Anyway, St. Vincent de Paul was the saint that founded my community, and one of the reasons he founded us is why I'm here, from where I live in St. Louis, Missouri, to preach parish missions. And as Father mentioned, and as you know, I'm sure by now, your parish mission begins tonight, right here in the church at 6.30, and then goes Monday and Tuesday. So I'm the one that has the privilege of leading and walking with you over the three days together. Now, let me ask you a question, a really important question. By a show of hands, how many of you think I look good in purple. No, just, I'm just kidding. No, no, here's the question. Is how many of you would like to feel closer to God in your life? All right, beautiful. Um, how many of you think, nah, I'm good? Okay, so we're all on the same page. <laughs> So if that's true, what you say, and, and what I mean by true is, is that something that you're willing to do something about? True. You know, I, I, it's not a question like, how many of you would like to eat candy and not get fat? You know, I mean, but this is something that you can do something about. So if you're willing to say yes to that, then the next question is really important. You want to feel closer to God? How? Right? I mean, then yes, yes. How can I do that? And the answer to that question is all over the scriptures. But I believe that St. James in Holy Scripture answers that question most beautifully when he tells us this. Draw near to God, and God will draw near to you. Yeah, that, that's how. <laughs> it's not anything more complicated than that. Draw near, give God that desire you have. Draw near to him, and God is going to draw near to you. No question. In other words, make some space in your life for God, and God will fill that space every time. But see, I think, friends, that as much as the desire we have for God raised your hands a moment ago, if there's a lot of other things in our life that's also pulling your attention and desire and time and space. You know, working out, friends, school, Netflix, you know, all of this stuff happening. And I think what we're reminded today, how much space are you giving to God? So friends, that is why we have this beautiful opportunity to make a little space together for him. And we call this opportunity a parish mission. And that's what you have before you, starting right here in the church tonight at 6.30, about 45 minutes, and then Monday and Tuesday. And what are we going to be doing over the course of the three evenings of our parish mission, making space for God? What are we going to be thinking, reflecting upon a really important question? Let me ask you this. 
How many of you want to go to heaven? How many of you don't want to go there? <laughs> yeah, obviously you'd be at the donut shop, not here. So, of course we do. Then that question is also important. Yeah, I want to get to heaven. How? And the answer to that question is what we're going to be reflecting upon over the three nights. There is a special password like everything else we have to get money, to listen to music, to do whatever, go banking, you need a password. You can have a million songs to listen to on Spotify, but if you don't have the password, you can't listen to one of them. You might want to be into heaven at the end of your days, that's awesome, but without the password, you ain't getting there. And the password we have is one that Jesus himself told us over and over again. It's not one word, it's three words actually. And that's what we're gonna be looking at, the three word password to enter the glory of God's love. So important. You know what the password is, the three words? I'm not gonna tell you, <laughs> not now. <laughs> that's what we're gonna be looking at over the three nights in a really lovely, enjoyable way for young people, old people, families, a beautiful way for families to come together with the Lord. Kids love it as well. So friends, I'm gonna end here, but thank you for listening. And let me call you back to the beginning of this. That thing that raised your hand. Again, if it is something that you want, then please make the effort to come to this space that we're gonna make for that God of ours to draw near. Tonight at 6.30, give it a shot. When's the last time you did this? And I promise you, you make that space tonight and God will reward anybody who comes to him with desire.